Blackguard Big Bogart is an NPC in Elden Ring with a very easily missed quest. It involves Raya and Dung Eater along with a lifetime supply of boiled crab, all of which will be covered in this guide. As usual, useful timestamps can be found in the video description. To start this quest, you'll actually need to speak with Raya in Lyurnia. You'll find her to the east of Scenic Isle in a pavilion near the Bird's Eye Telescope. Unfortunately, if you've already spoken to Tanith at Volcano Manor, then Raya will have relocated to the manor and you'll not even be able to start Blackguard Bogart's quest. Assuming you're able to find Raya in the pavilion, speak with her and she'll eventually tell you about a fellow tarnished that stole her necklace. Agree to retrieve it for her, then head north to the Boiled Prawn Shack and speak with Bogart. He'll act sullenly upon first contact, but just mention the stolen necklace and then purchase it from him for 1,000 ruins. Afterwards, you can speak with Bogart again to open his shop of unlimited boiled prawns. To advance the quest, you'll need to purchase at least one boiled prawn from the shop. If you've done all that, then Bogart will eventually move to his new location, the Outer Moat near the Capital Rampart site of Grace. What triggers Bogart to move to this new location is not certain, but probably involves one of two things. The first is activating the Grand Lift of Dectus. You'll need to get both halves of the Dectus Medallion, one can be found at Fort Height in Southeast Limgrave, and the other half can be found at Fort Faroth in Kaled. Once you have the complete medallion, take it to the Grand Lift of Dectus in northeastern Lyurnia. You can get to it by traveling up along the west side of Lyurnia Lake. After reaching the main Caria Manor Gate site of Grace, head east and use a stone spire bridge to cross over to the east side, then make your way north to the lift. The second is gaining access to Landale Royal Capital. To do that, acquire two great runes and defeat the Draconic Tree Sentinel guarding the northern entrance to the capital ramparts. In addition to the boiled prawns, Bogart will sell boiled crabs at the Outer Moat location. They are similar to boiled prawns but will increase physical damage negation to an even greater extent. Despite being better, they are actually the same price as boiled prawns. Get your fill of crabs and then speak with Bogart and go through all of his dialogue relating to Dung Eater before leaving. Next, you'll need to collect at least one seedbed curse. The easiest one to get is right after entering the royal capital. Start at the capital rampart site of Grace and walk along the beaten path until reaching a lift. After taking it down, you'll find a ladder in the next building that leads up to the first seabed curse. Afterwards, speak to Dung Eater at Roundtable Hold. After noticing the seedbed curse in your inventory, he'll give you the sewer jail key and tell you to find and release his corporeal body in the Landell sewers. Starting from the West Capital Rampart site of Grace, head northwest and make your way down to the streets below. A short distance to the northeast, there's a fairly hidden water well that will take you down to the sewers. Make your way through the sewers until you reach the underground roadside site of Grace. From the underground roadside site of Grace, head out to the northeast and take the drop on your left.
follow the path to the northwest and make your way past a few giant poisonous flowers. After climbing up the ladder, watch out for the giant spider hand on the ceiling above. On the far side of the chamber, you'll find an iron door that opens with the key. Enter and speak with the physical form of Dung Eater and tell him to leave, then go through the rest of his dialogue. After releasing Dung Eater, return to his spot at Round Table Hold. You'll find a message that reads, Come to the Outer Moat. Head back to Bogart's location and speak through all of his new dialogue. Then reload the game and return to the moat to find the poor Blackguard in an injured state. Interact with him and he'll drop his armor set, bell bearing, and a seed bed curse. Make sure to pick up all of those items quickly before being invaded by Dung Eater just in case you die. Then of course you'll need to defeat Dung Eater as part of his questline. After the invasion, you can take Bogart's bell bearing to the twin maiden husks to unlock a lifetime supply of boiled crab. And that's about it for Big Bogart's quest. If you're still having trouble with this quest, you can reach out in the comment section where I'll do my best to help. I also recommend checking the pinned comment I have, as I'll be updating it with information about specific problems people are having and potential solutions. I'm working on guides for all the major quests in Elden Ring. If you want to find those, you can head over to my channel, and if you're new, consider subscribing. You're helping me feed my cat, her name's Marshmallow. There's also a Marshmallow merch store now, featuring Elden Ring-inspired artwork of your favorite fluffball. Have a great day, if you're here today, have a great Thursday, and as always, thanks for watching.